Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to effectively change the font on your Microsoft Word document you're working on. So this is going to be a pretty straightforward tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. So a couple of different ways we can do this. The first one would be if you're just trying to change a certain areas font. So you don't want to change everything on the document, but you just want to change, let's say, some of the header information. You just want to highlight over with your mouse. So while holding down the left mouse clicker or mouse pointer, you want to drag it over whatever area you want to change the font for. And then you can go up to the top left in the font box. And if you click on the little drop down arrow, you can see a bunch of different fonts that are in here. And you actually will get a preview of it depending on how far over this box is. So actually, you can also do this if you highlight over this area. You can click inside this box as well, and you have the same option to modify that font as well. If you have a font in mind, you can change it right through here. So let's say I'm going to start typing in Calibri, and I'm going to select Calibri body here. And we can see this specific font has changed, but the rest of it has not. Now, if we want to change the entire document's font, all you have to do is either drag your left mouse pointer and hold down on it while selecting the whole document, or a faster way, if you have a lot of pages, would be to hold down the Control and the A key on your keyboard at the same time. So you might notice there's two Control keys on your keyboard. Just pick whichever one you're more comfortable holding down, and then the A key. So just hold them down for about one or two seconds and then release. And now at this point you can go up to the ta the font box at the top and you can start typing in whatever font you want to change it to. Another important feature about this is if you see there's no font listed in here, that means that there are two or more different kinds of fonts being used on this document. And the same goes for the font size. So we can see 12, so that means this entire document is in size 12 font. If we change this header information's font size, there, this box would be blank as well. It's very good for proofing documents. You want to make sure generally that the font and the text size is the same throughout. So let's say we're going to change it to Calibri Light the whole thing. And then once you can see it automatically starts auto filling it in once you get a, to a certain point in typing in and in. And then just to select this, I'm going to hit enter on my keyboard. And we can see the entire document has changed. And you can achieve the same result for changing the font size as well. But this is a pretty straightforward tutorial. And I do want to point out if you have any page numbers, you're going to have to go up inside the header information up at the top and then independently change the font for that. I do not believe the methods that we showed today are going to work for the header. So you'd have to independently, once you're done doing the body, you'd have to go up to the header and change that. I think it's just important to note because it doesn't look good if your page number is in a different font than your body font. So uh, just a little helpful tidbit of information there. But I do hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.